Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport 3. Today is episode number 21. If you want to help support the channel, then leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe, and feel free to check out the other videos in the Forza Mega Series. Now let's get into the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. If you want to get cheap game keys for Xbox, PlayStation, or PC, then check out Eniba in the description down below. All right, so we are here for the Supra versus Fair Lady Z. Uh, we're taking the old school 84 Supra for this. Go away, Bigsby. Cheers, Bigsby. Anyways, uh, yeah, so we're going to carry on with this. We're starting off with the Camino Vio de Montserrat, Amalfi Coast, Sedona Raceway Park, and then Circuit de Catalunya. Let's go. All right, here we go. First race. I've just realized we're going to have a big wing on the back of this thing, aren't we? Yep. Do you know what, though? The wing actually suits it. I'll be totally honest. It actually suits this car. Nothing nice whatever, but I'm going for the moment, so just chill. So the problem that I'm going to have... Um, I'm basically wanting to complete all of the, uh, the manufacturer events first. Because these are the ones where I have to buy quite a few cars to make sure that I've got it. Um, but then what I'm going to do is probably sell a large majority of cars so that I can buy one R1 vehicle. Uh, the cheapest is like a million. That's all I need is the cheapest. As long as I can then complete the rest of the amateur events. Then once I'm done with that, I can move on to semi-pro. Which is where we start doing um, just class-based events. Um, I believe there's some sort of special ones, but if I sell a car that I need for one of them, I'll just rebuy it again. Because by that point, the credit earnings will be a lot more dramatic. But obviously, I'm trying to do everything in order, so. Oh my god, it's a bitch. A bitch has joined my chat. <laughs> What's up, Cannibal? How are you today? Hopefully you're having a good day. Kind of surprised that that rear light on the right is still working. Getting a party ready for tomorrow. Ah, fair enough. Well, hopefully you have a good time at your party. Whatever it's for, or whatever it's going to be. Hopefully you have fun. I haven't been to a party in fucking ages. Shut up, Bigsby. Stupid thing. This car is actually really quick. Interior's nice in it too as well. We're pretty much, if as long as, if I was a little more steady through that section, easily would have hit 140 miles an hour. I was at 137, and I had a little wobble as we were going through there. Help is on the way. There you go. Result. 6,700 for that. We're getting very close to level 31. Uh, we now got a 10% discount on air filter upgrades by 
in Jan. I believe once we hit level 31, that's when we start getting race cars. So R3, 2, and 1. All right, race 2. Yeah, the Strokes are actually kind of an underrated band. They've made so many... How the hell did I manage to shift up twice that quick? Uh, apparently the AI is a little bit stupid today. Meanwhile, I... I'm gonna storm the pack. Why are you hitting my car? Get away from me car! Meow. That's not my front bumper. Whose front bumper is that? I think that might be the other Supra then, maybe. I assume there's another one of these cars that's on the grid. She said to lose my mind or lose my life. I'm looking forward to the uh, full Amalfi Coast races because the Amalfi Coast actually is... It's similar to what Test Track was, where it's like a really, really ridiculously stupidly long track. Obviously, you've got this nice circuit here that's a decent length that's got a nice variety, but there is an extremely long version of it as well. It winds all the way up through there. That's why when you look towards the uh, end of this track, like there's a bit on that way. I believe that's where it comes on and then instead of it going that way, it goes up towards that direction. This is sort of like a middle section that they've just taken out of the full track. But yeah, excited for that, those ones specifically. Nurburgring one's going to be good as well. I think they got three in this game. You got the Amalfi Coast, the Fujimi Kaido, the mountain in Japan, uh, which returns from Motorsport 1. It sort of took a hiatus for Motorsport 2. And then Nurburgring. Die at the same time. And die at the same time. And die at the same time. Let's go out together and die at the same time. There we go. Nice race there. 8,900 credits. We're now level 31. 
And Holden has sent us a Team Commodore. And we've also got a 10% discount on flywheel upgrades by Fidanza Japan for Lexus Ski on and Toyota. I believe this Commodore is actually a supercar. One of the uh, V8 supercars from the Australian racing leagues. It's like an Australian motorsport. Yeah, it looks like one of them. It's a lovely car, actually. Yeah, V8 Supercars Australia. Proving my point. All right, here we go. I believe this is race number three now. I think it's race number three. Yeah, it must be. And if it's not wild well, bugger, new memory's gone to shit. Mondays is for drinking to the seldom seen kid. I've been working on a cocktail for grounds for divorce. Whoa. Meow. Meow. Sedona Raceway. Which of late I cannot help but Oh. Holy crap, that was quick. Mondays is for drinking to the seldom sinking. Not bad. This thing is surprisingly stable. I think I made a good choice to upgrade this rather than uh, what's it called? Buy a, buy a new car. In terms of variety, sure, it might have been more enjoyable to try a different car, but this was good. Plus, I don't have the money. Well, I do have the money, but I'm trying to save up a million. And if I spend it, that means I'm just throwing money away at that point. Because, I mean, this car, even though it cost me, like, 50 grand to upgrade it, I'll still get about 30 grand of that back, plus the value of the car, if I choose to sell this, which... This probably will get sold. Bloody hell, that sunlight is ridiculous. Yeah, so I'll probably end up selling this car at some point. As well as that Brera, that Alfa Romeo, that's going... Nice. Result. Let's have a look, see what uh, credits we got. Not bad. Ah, lovely. That was a good drink. 
strawberry and apple cider. Never gonna sleep again. I don't know why, but any cider that's got strawberry flavor, I absolutely love it. Ah, and strawberry flavored Ribena. I don't know if Ribena's in America, but in the UK we got this squash. It's basically a drinks company called Ribena. They make blackcurrant squash, um, which is like a dilute drink. Uh, again, it's more for Americans to understand than us Brits, because us Brits know what the fuck squash is. Um, but then you also have um, normal, like, pre-mixed juices that they sell. They sell, like, you can go to a shop and just buy a bottle of juice from there. Um, but yeah, they pretty much, the only flavors I've ever seen them do is just pure black currant, not apple and black currant, just black currant, and just strawberry. And oh my god, they are amazing. I can't remember any other flavors that they do, to be honest, if they do do any, because I haven't seen them in a while. But, oh my god, Ribena was the shit. Oh, and raspberry. They did raspberry as well. They did strawberry, raspberry, blackcurrant. There we go. Not bad. Not bad. Keep it going. Right, we have one lap remaining. It's our final lap. Can I catch up with last place in this time? I think we might actually be able to. Ah, uh, not quite. Close, but no cigar. Oh, and the car's off. Oh, no! Seven and a half grand, not bad. Let's see, how much rewards did we get? Eleven grand. We're still losing money. All right, so we are here for the Honda Acura owners meeting. We're going to be taking the Honda NSX-R GT for this one. Starting off with Twin Ring, Mategi, Sakuba, Iberian, and then Maple Valley. And by the looks of it, our rewards prices are starting to go up. We've seen like four and a half, five grand for our races. We're now up into like six grand. Uh, and I can only assume once we start getting a bit lower down, we'll start seeing a little more credits. 
when it comes to race rewards. So let's get going. All right, here we go. Yeah, the NSX, very nice car. And obviously we got the GT version, which has that little uh, airbox scoop on it. This car is above the recommended uh, performance index of the event. We're actually in B class, and the recommended is C. But, uh, oh well. I wanted to take this car and give it for a spin. Spinella. It is toasty. Not bad. This thing's uh, taking this track really nicely, actually. We got those slower Hondas are actually still on lap two. I think we're going to be lapping cars by lap four. End of lap four. Maybe, um, what's it called? Start of lap five. Around that region, we'll start lapping cars. There you go, you can see the slower car there. Come on, we can catch up! This camera angle seems really far away, actually. I was like, we must be on the wrong angle. It's very strange. Like, the difference between that and that is like nothing, so that's why I find it a bit odd. Taking the same line again that we took the other lap. It was like lap three, maybe lap four, that we did that wider line. Say goodbye. Didn't quite catch up quick enough to get another another car. Got two of them though, which is fine. Uh eight grand there. Car level is now level one. We got forty percent discount on ignition upgrades by NGK. Nice. Not bad. I love the look of the Honda Honda rims, they are beautiful.
One year, seven months, 23 days. Not bad. Not bad at all. Getting close to two years now. Because it was, what, start of 2021? You found my Twitch? Quite a while ago. God, it feels like ages. I mean, in a couple of weeks' time, my YouTube, like, this whole YouTube channel is four years old. Like, the channel itself is older, but, like, my first video that I properly kept up there, that I said, let's do it, it will have been four years ago, which is crazy. <laughs> to outer space. I mean, my Twitch account was made back in 2016, so Twitch itself is nearly six years old. So. But I got back into Twitch in September 2020, so. To find another race. Oh shit, the um, ERC's on tonight. Fuck. Well, I am busy recording, so I can't even watch it. I'll watch back on it. Once I finish this and I start editing. I take a brain to another dimension. I take a brain to another dimension. <gasps> Pay close attention. Right, on to the final lap. And we're catching up with the back markers now. Get your ass back here. Yeah, I had done that so well with not a single bit of damage and ruined it at the end. Bugger. Alright, 8,600, not too bad. Now level 2, we got 40% discount on fuel system upgrades by AEM. Nice.
There we go. Okay, so uh, my microphone decided to kill itself. Luckily, it was only during that... Um, during that race. Because I did check that my microphone could hear me when I moved, and it was fine. So, you know. That's the one annoyance of using uh, NVIDIA Broadcast. Then again, I can't really blame Broadcast because it's because my microphone keeps disconnecting, reconnecting. Philosophy. bad Meow. I definitely need to find some more songs for this playlist here we go level 32 we got a Ferrari 62 Rizzi Competizione F430 GT, and we got a 40% discount on differential upgrades by cars. Here's my key. Philosophy. Oh, not bad at all. It's got the Most Will 2 logo on it, though. Interesting. All right, we have just hit 20 hours in this playthrough. 20 hours of time played. So that we definitely haven't got 20 hours of footage. But oh well. Mathematically speaking, I believe... I think we're about 20% of the way through the game. I know my spreadsheet probably says about 25% at the moment, but in terms of like additional length to the events and all that, I think we should be good. Power, we can't get this party started until we have got the power. Now. Yo, once was a kid with the other little kids. Tell mommy I'm sorry. This life is a party. Hey, hey. I love this song. It's a tune.
Hey, hey. I'm not gonna lie, Need for Speed has some of the best soundtrack in any racing game. Especially like 2010 and 2012. Their soundtracks were class. Come on, get out the way. Get out my way. Nice. Tell mommy I'm sorry. This life is a party. Hey, hey. Sorry, this life is a party. I'm never growing up. Right, coming up to the finish line. Damn. Not bad. Let's get our rewards. go result under akira owners meeting done so thank you guys so much for watching if you did enjoy be sure to leave a like comment down below and subscribe and i will see you in the next one peace out